For centuries, humans have marveled at the seemingly uncanny instincts of animals, from pets that appear to know when their owners are coming home to wildlife that seems to predict natural disasters. Today, we embark on a fascinating journey into the world of animal precognition, exploring how this phenomenon challenges our understanding of cognition and opens new avenues for research in animal behavior and ecology. Primitive Precognition and the Planarian Worm Experiment. In April 2016, Fernando Alvarez published a paper entitled An Experiment on Precognition with Planarian Worms in the Journal of Scientific Exploration. This groundbreaking study was conducted on black planarian Girardia doroto cephala, simple aquatic organisms possessing only primitive nervous systems. The study was designed to see if a planarian worm could predict a random noxious stimulus, demonstrating a remarkable ability to anticipate future events. Alvarez's experimental setup was meticulous. Planarian worms were placed in a testing chamber one at a time with 43 experimental subjects and 37 control subjects. All subjects had the same time course of observation. After three minutes in the testing chamber, one of two different possibilities would occur randomly. Either one, a startling sound would occur, or two, a control moment of silence was presented. All worms were filmed during the experiment, and the frequency of worm head movements was observed, as worm head movement represents distress or ambient exploration. The results were astounding. Non-parametric comparisons of the frequencies of head movements showed that values obtained during two observation periods for the experimental planarians were significantly higher than those during the corresponding observation periods for the control planarians. These results suggest that planarians are able to anticipate future events at least one minute before they occur. The frequencies of head movements during the two observation periods one minute before and immediately before stimulation for the experimental planarians more than doubled that of values during the corresponding observation periods for the control subjects. The paper's author, Fernando Alvarez, concluded that the significantly higher frequency of head movement supports the idea that planarians are able to anticipate future events. This phenomenon is anomalous in the sense of lacking an explanation in today's scientific paradigms. Precognition across the animal kingdom. The planarian study is just one piece of a larger puzzle. Numerous other species have demonstrated behaviors suggestive of precognitive abilities. This and other studies appear to indicate that most animals are likely able to behaviorally predict the future. Birds, nature's prophets. Research has shown that certain bird species exhibit behavior suggesting precognitive abilities. Bengalese finches displayed anticipatory alarm behavior as reported by Alvarez in the Journal of Scientific Exploration. Zebra finches demonstrated a higher anticipatory response at specific times as documented by Alvarez in the Journal of Parapsychology. Mammals from mice to dogs. Mammals, too, have shown intriguing signs of precognitive abilities. In a 1968 study by Duval and Montredam, published in the Journal of Parapsychology, mice demonstrated an ability to avoid randomly electrified areas of their cage more often than chance would predict. Dogs have shown extraordinary abilities that suggest a form of precognition. Sheldrake and Smart, in 1998 and 2000, conducted videotaped experiments and observations of a dog that seemed to know when its owner was returning. Published in the Journal of the Society for Psychical Research and the Journal of Scientific Exploration. Rodden in 2002 further explored this phenomenon, considering the effect of environmental variables in the Journal of Scientific Exploration. Predictive Anticipatory Activity, or PAA, extends beyond the animal kingdom into human cognition. PAA is defined as statistically reliable differences 
between physiological measures recorded seconds before an unpredictable emotional event occurs versus seconds before an unpredictable neutral event occurs. While the term precognition would apply more to a perception or a behavior than to an unconscious physiological measure, PAA provides valuable insights into anticipatory phenomena. A meta-analysis conducted by Mossbridge, Trisoldi, and Utz in 2012 confirmed that human physiology has successfully been used to predict future random events. The phenomenon is based on unconscious physiological data, challenging our understanding of time and causality. The study of precognition in animals has profound implications for our understanding of cognition, time, and reality itself. From an evolutionary perspective, the presence of anticipatory behaviors in primitive organisms like planarians, which are the most primitive animals with the central nervous system, suggests that precognitive abilities may have deep evolutionary roots. Their cerebral ganglia represent the most primitive type of brain in animal evolution. Rethinking time and causality, the apparent fact that humans and animals behaviorally predict the future disrupts our commonly held ideas regarding causality since we have tended to attribute causality to a forward movement in time. If the future is in fact influencing how we react in the present moment, we'll have to reinvent an entirely new way of thinking about causality. This concept, known as retrocausation, challenges our linear understanding of time and cause-effect relationships, consciousness and reality. These findings invite us to reconsider the nature of consciousness and its role in shaping our perception of reality. The goal is to understand the biological mechanisms involved in anomalous anticipatory activity. The results obtained with birds, mammals, and even primitive organisms like planarians suggest that the phenomenon of precognition occurs across a wide range of species, from those with highly developed nervous systems to the most basic. This universal nature of anticipatory behavior suggests that it may be a fundamental aspect of life itself, transcending the boundaries of species and complexity.